Drum roll, please. So the big reveal. That's the eyes, the much hyped hairs, yeah, the strands, the ears, the zip. There you go. I told you, right? All the paint will be worth it. That's my take on a pretty lady. <laughs> about lights how light comes specifically and how it makes a difference to your sketch and how to use light to bring your sketch to life yeah but first let's quickly see how I reached here and then I'll be back again with my hands <laughs> So if you see this part of my uh, face which I'm drawing in this it's completely mostly dark yeah and also think this place eyebrow below to the eyebrow and before the eyes like just just in that center zone it's always 80% of the times this place will be darker because uh, that's a that's kind of a there's a depth in there and that's why light cannot go in so this has to be darker. Yeah, and interesting part is this, this is the nose and lips, so how you need to look forward to this or how I look forward to this is specifically there will be a height to this, so it's 3D, right, like think about this, there is, if I see a face, so if I see a person, this place should have a height and you need to make, portray it in a manner so that it has a height, right, so this part of the nose, I'm going to make it darker. So I'll show you this part of the nose. I'm going to make it darker. So and this part, I'll, I'll just make it bright. So the, the moment I try doing this, you will see if I try doing this. Yes. So you see this, the moment I try making it bright and this darker so and then just blend a little see here there's a there's a kind of a depth right there see we can see right there's a depth coming in that's how you need to do it and tomorrow is blend till end day so here what you see here uh, so yeah I have placed the areas where this is one and this is two and then this is three this is four and uh, this is five. So this is not exactly a place where light is coming in, but I want it to be. Uh, there's a. I want to blend it with. I don't want it to be completely dark. Yeah. So uh, point. Uh, what I have done is I added a background color to this. That's kind of an ash color, grayish. And uh, more importantly, there, what I want to have is. I want to set a base tone for my uh, for the face, specifically the face. So this is this entire area, right? So let me just get back to the old one. Yes. So yeah, here what I'll start with, I'll start blending this very slowly. You see, uh, so this area, and always what I try to do is because it's a uh, don't use airbrushes. And because uh, it will take at the texture from the skin. see this looks pretty good after the blending right yeah so the eyes man this, this looks pretty right <laughs> yeah 
Yeah. So uh, let me tell you the trick about eyes, which I generally do first. Uh, of course, you need to make sure both are in the same line. Yeah, this alignment should be correct. And more importantly, this uh, highlight, right? Highlight is very, very important. So here specifically, this this little bit of white, you see, that's the light coming in. That's very important. And uh, if you see about the eyebrows, which I wanted to do, and which I wanted to mention also in this specific sketch, is uh, even I used to do the mistake of you know just smudging the entire thing and then so that it's all look blended and nice but no eyebrows most importantly there should be separate strands of hair the way you see here this one uh, there's separate strands of hair which are highlighted so if you do that then it will look more and uh, much more real than if it were smudged and then blended one yeah Let's go to another part which I want to put the attention to. That's the this part here. That's the zip. So here, what I wanted to make sure is this part. I want to blend a little bit. Yeah. What? So this part because this is a jacket, right? This part, the most amount of light is coming through. So this this has to be brighter. This entire section will be bright. So if you see, I have also made it light and this thing, and then the zip also is reflecting because that's metal. Final touches. <laughs> Damn you, Matt Preston, you spoiled me. So let's finish with the hairs.